Hi everyone and welcome to the English of everything. Today we're going to describe this picture of a street scene. So, let's begin. The first thing you will notice, from the very bottom of the picture, leading up to the group of people, there are some white lines across the road. And this is called a pedestrian crossing. It's also known as a zebra crossing. And this is where pedestrians, or people who are walking, will cross the road. On the opposite side of the pedestrian crossing, or the zebra crossing, there is a large crowd of people, which is, means there is a large group of people and they are waiting to cross the road. Now these people are standing on the edge of the curb. They are standing on the pavement. Pavement is where pedestrians and people walk, and the curb is the edge of the pavement where it meets the road. These people are waiting for the signal, the small green man, to uh, cross the road. Above the heads of the people, there is a traffic light. Actually, in this picture, there are five traffic lights that I can see, and they all have red lights. And on a traffic light, there are three lights. There is red for stop, there is green for go, and there is amber for giving you a warning when it will stop or when it will start. Uh, a lot of people say yellow or orange, but in England especially, we use the word amber to describe the middle colour. The traffic lights are attached to street lights, and you can see a large pole going up, and on the top of this pole there is a light. And these street lights are there to illuminate the street. Next to the group of pedestrians on the opposite pavement, there are some signs advertising the shops. And these signs are called neon signs. So on the souvenirs, you have a red neon sign and a blue neon sign. And you can see all the way down the street into the background, there are lots of ne neon signs advertising different bars, restaurants and shops. Right, if you look to the right-hand side of the picture, at the top right, you will see there is some advertising. And we call these advertising billboards. And also advertising hoardings. I'm not going to say which product it is. It's a popular soft drink. Uh, but these are advertising billboards. You can see there are a lot of cars in this picture. And uh, in the middle there's a silver car and it is turning left. The other cars are waiting at the intersection. Now, intersection is an American word. In England, we use the word crossroads. So this is a crossroads, and some cars are waiting to go because of the traffic lights, and some cars are already turning. The last one for this picture, next to the silver car that is turning at the crossroads, there are two circles on the floor. These things are called manhole covers manhole covers and uh, underneath them it leads down to the sewers um, which is where all the waste water and everything from your bathroom goes these are manhole covers and they are made of metal and uh, they are there so people can go down into the sewers so this is everything for now this is a very basic description of this photo i hope it gives you some new vocabulary and helps you to describe pictures a little bit better have a nice day. Bye-bye.